I have been vulva doused this I know. week. She had quite the private session yesterday. Oh, well, that and all the other stuff. Yeah, Leonore's writing about her, you know, New View campaign where she's... Orgasm Inc., where they're going after yeah, Big Pharma. Yeah, and this business of removing women's labia because they want to... They don't want to... What your line is, they're afraid to be... This is what I don't understand about women. You don't want anyone to think you're a slut, but everyone wants to have a pussy like a porn star. It's like... <laughs> like what is that? I don't what know. What is that. going on? This culture is like spinning out of their minds, out of control. Either, so, either you hate your pussy or you or you uh, worship it. I, yeah, it doesn't seem it's extreme. Now, I'm on the other end. I worship mine. Oh, and I mine have is the most beautiful snatch in the world. Yes, you, the, no, I, I do. I agree with she you. She said I had a million dollar oh, C word. Whatever you want, darling. <laughs> I think the C word is a cunt. <laughs> oh, please. So, it's just it, this whole idea of doing that mirror work with my client yesterday that sitting in front of that makeup mirror and putting a bright light on your vulva and doing the vulva massage and if this is for someone who is working uh, working through a problem of, of sexual abuse and so the idea and it doesn't matter or you know we've all been abused or body image we're all abused by our culture yes and all, every woman and, is. and we have we have genital shame just dripping out of our ears yes. so to sit there and to pet and do massage and, and look at it while you're doing it, mm -hmm. she said, oh, this is completely different than doing stimulation to get turned on. Absolutely. You're not waiting for some guy or some woman between your legs and waiting for their response. Like, we've never looked at it. So we always go into a sex act and we're like, well, is it good? We don't know. And we're going in with negative energy. We should go into that sex act like, damn, look what I got. I got the goods. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's the healing. You're going to get a makeup mirror or some smaller mirror that you can prop up so that you can sit on the floor or the bed or the sofa, but you must be comfortable. You have to be able to lean against something, and then you get some kind of light source, a little desk lamp. A desk lamp's is, great. Is what I'm using. And you aim it between your legs, and you turn it on, and you look. The spotlight's on you. Spotlight, <laughs> and it's like, you know, every time we do it in, in a session, I always, you know, Clap. there's the applause, and ta-da, and it's beautiful. <laughs> So then you get the oil, and we're using the almond, the almond oil. Almond oil, and you rub it on your hands, and you go down, and it's hand over hand, while you are watching, 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 and now feeling, 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 and then positive reinforcement. Talk about how pretty it is. Uh, look at the shaft. Find the gl the glands. Pull back on your clitoral hood. Oh yes, and open it up and look on the inside and admire admire this work of art and the joy and the pleasure it can give yes. you so every, and everyone, it's yours that's the point it's own it. yours it's your sex organ for pleasure it's own not it. a man's it's not this culture's it's your sex organ absolutely own it love it and enjoy it